This is how we do it in the Central Coast, man. We got 40 ounces, old English, rag tops, six foreign collars, and bikini girls, man. This is how we do it on the West Coast. San Diego, San Francisco, Los Angeles. But don't forget about the Central Cali, man. Please don't forget about the Central Cali. Yeah, get them. It's another sunny day in the state of California Low water palm trees, them G's that put it on ya This ain't a negative, we speaking in bonnets Rag talk, candy paint on these with hydraulics Baseball hat with the sticker on the ring Don't let the shine blind your sight cause things can get real But I'm not here to talk about banana clips and guns We're going back to Cali and we're gonna have some fun A West Coast domination And welcome back to Two-Face Entertainment Podcast I am your host, Fred Segura here in Central California, also known as the Salad Bowl, the Monterey Bay, um, Central Kelly, 831, all day, baby. Cool. That's where we're at. We're, we are uh, north to the people in L.A., we're north. To the people in San Francisco, we're south. Best of both worlds, don't forget about the Central Kelly. Anyway, guys, today I'm here representing uh, New Trend, Central Coast Finest. Uh, it's been around since 1986. I was uh, fortunate to join the club in 1989. However, with that being said, guys, um, this podcast is about losing uh, two brothers of the car club community. Rest in peace to uh, Jose Mag. Magdaleno, who we lost in uh, December of 2022, and to Ruben Cadena, who we lost in early in 2023. Uh, Mag was before becoming uh, when he first got into the car club. He was he was uh, uh, from the car club uh, Crusaders, <clears throat> and then in <clears throat> Excuse me. In the nineties, he 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 joined us in, with New Trend, and uh, when things, you know, uh, we all went about our ways, and you know, life after New Trend, I would call it, um, it kind of disbanded, but the brotherhood was still there. Um, Meg, you know, Meg started up with Crusaders again, and we were fortunate enough to to start up New Trend again, as well. With that being said, guys, uh, Ruben Cadenas was part of a, a street life car club out of Salinas. Um, all local, all local car clubs and stuff like that. Shout outs to all of them. I'm not gonna get into all the names, guys. There's too many to mention. I don't want nobody to come back at me and be like, "You didn't mention us," and so on and so forth. However, with that being said, guys, um, one thing in particular, um, I ran into. Um, in, in into uh, Ruben one day and um, well at at his shop, at the shop where he worked at and stuff and doing batteries. Uh, long story short, he gave me a battery. You know, my daughter was with me. Uh, she was like, "What? Did he just give you a battery?" You know, when we're in the car, back in the car, and I said, "Yeah, you know, I go. There's good people in the world." You know, I said, um, "You know." Um, but that means we also got to be good as well. It's not just one sided. It's a two way street, you know. Um, Meg was the kind of person that he was a sarcastic, quick witted, big guy, intimidating. Um, even if people, I saw people call him out on his flaws and stuff like that, and he not only deflected that, but he threw it back at them like, "Hey, you know, you." Um, uh, it's your insecurity, not mine, you know, and, and he would laugh it off, and there was really nothing that anybody could come back at him with, but anyhow, um, both great people, um, one of the beautiful things about, about it, guys, was when I introduced my children to these guys, uh, and to everybody else as well, you know what I mean, that, that are still here, uh, I always had that intent of, not for the fact of like, hey, you know, these are my kids, and da, da, da. no, it was more of the of the intent of, you know, proud of my children, obviously, but as well as, <clears throat> and I told my children this. I said, listen, 
I go, God forbid I'm not on this earth anymore. You know, I happen to pass. You get into some kind of uh, situation where you need something, for example, say a car. It doesn't, and it doesn't have to be for, for cars all the time. It could be anything. But let's just, for, for the sake of, of, of what this podcast is today, uh, let's just say it's it's deals with with the car issue, um, be it paint, be it whatever it is, you know, hydraulics or whatever. I always told them, I always and I still tell them, what happens is, I want there to be like, hey, you know what? When you go somewhere, and be like, hey, I know who you are, you know, hey, you're, you're uh, so and so's, uh, you know, your friend's boy or your friend, your friend's uh, daughter. You know, and they they're gonna help you out. Your dad was a good man. You know that kind that kind of stuff. You know because again, you try to behave accordingly with people as well. You know, and um, so that's always been my thing. You know to try to try to to try to do that. Um, uh, life takes its course, guys, and we go upon our different ways and stuff like that. But it's seeing people just pass back to back and, and so on and so forth. It's not the first time either. And we continuously kind of in a cliche way say, oh, we got to get together more often and not stuff like this. And then we go on with life and then just forget about it until unfortunately we happen to meet up at, the, at under those circumstances. But what I'm trying, what, what, I'm, what I'm really saying, guys, is that I think we really need to take that initiative in life. And that means with anybody and anything, you know, in this situation to try to be like, hey, man, how are you doing? How, are you, how have you been? Hey, you know what? Let's go do whatever. I don't care. Let's hang out. I'm going to stop by and say hi. Whatever. It takes a couple of, couple of minutes out of your day, especially with technology nowadays, guys. It, it, you know, I think that's important, you know. And 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 it's it's a it's a beautiful thing, you know. And it's sad to be under the circumstances. Amongst that being said, guys, uh, one of the beautiful things I see about it, though, is that sometimes people, you know, in life we bicker about each other. Oh, you know, this and this and that, you know, whatever, whatever. Um, one of the beautiful things that I really took me like, wow, is to see the local car clubs come together at both services for uh, our, our brother uh, Jose Mag Magdaleno and for our brother Ruben Cadenas, Cadena out here in, in, in Salinas. Um, there's not that much pride to where we hold on to, no, well, we're so-and-so. No, no, hey, respect and respect is given you know, to, to our fallen brothers, because I look at it as we're all brothers, regardless of whatever car club they're from. We're all brothers. We, we're all in, in the car club community. You know, we're all one. And we don't need a logo to represent that. And here's what shows it. You know, the love and the dedication to each other. To see, hey, how you doing, man? Hey, good to see you. You know, yada, 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 that kind of stuff. And, and, and me, myself, guys, I mean, I, not just me, it happens to everybody. I get into like a whole thing of like, oh my God, I, I, I wish I, you know, I want to get my truck done. I want to get my truck done. I, I, you know, da, da, da. It, it, and it stresses us out sometimes. Sometimes life doesn't, does not allow us to move as quick as we want it to and, and get our things done as fast as we want them to get them done. You know, sometimes life, Hits us, you know, from, you know, we're going one way and we get sideswiped, you know, it's like, oh man, I got to, you know, I got to take care of this stuff first before I can focus on this. And it's hard, but you know what, guys? One thing I, I've, I've focused on, it, it's, it's not only about the cars, because the day, God forbid, that we pass, that car's truck, whatever you have, whatever it is, that symbol that, you know, represents us as, as one, as, you know, first as brotherhood. But that thing, that materialistic vehicle is going, is going to be there. And that's, and that's fine. I'm not knocking it. What I'm saying is it's not just about that. It's what we, the legacy we leave behind on this earth for others to be like, hey, man, you know, I remember, you know, Fred, I remember so-and-so. I remember so-and-so, you know, and they were good people. 
And that's his vehicle. That's his kids with the vehicle now. Whatever the situation is, guys, that's what's most important in life. You know, um, I want to... Uh, I, to me, this is a little bit more different of a, of a, of a podcast today. Um, I had I had a different idea in mind to make things a little bit longer, but I want to make it special and short and sweet, guys. Um, just, man, really, it's, it's a beautiful thing for everybody to come together as one. Regardless, it's almost like the like in the movie, like one of my brotherhood, one of my brothers from from New Jersey said, "Man, when you went out there and spoke for it, it was kind of like the, like the like like in the movie The Warriors. Those of you seen it, you okay? And you dig it? You know, Cyrus, you know, saying, hey, you know, we got so and so right next to so and so, and they're they're cool. So that's really it, guys. I mean, at the end of the day, I want to make it short and sweet. I want to get into more stuff, but at the end of the day, that's the bottom line." Love and respect. You know, um, I wanna, I wanna also end this. I'm not gonna end this typically where I'm like, you know, I'm Fred Segura signing out kind of deal. Um, I'm just gonna put a, a little, uh, you know, the pictures at the end of this podcast, and take it as the moment of silence for our fallen brothers, okay, who we've recently lost, and and we've lost more and you know others in, in 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 past times but um i'm not gonna make a big old slideshow like that it, this is for the two that have passed from the car club community love and respect shout out to uh street life car club uh, on behalf of myself and my brothers of new trend um we would give our condolences to not only street life but the family as well of uh of Ruben Cadena and love and respect also to Mag Magdaleno, uh, Jose Mag Magdaleno, our, our love and respect to the Crusaders Car Club out of Salinas, California, and their families.